There's, there's been a controversy that, that has always gone on about training to failure. Now in the body movement world, it was always the thing, man. You train till your eyeballs bleed, till failure and all. And when I talk about training heavy and intensely, I'm not always talking about training to failure. Not on every set anyway. There will be sets, there is always gonna be sets in every workout where I will go to failure though. Not usually the strength sets. Like I don't normally like to take my powerlifting sets, like if it's a squat or a dead, especially at this, this stage of the game, it keeps me from getting busted up as much. You know, I've, I've had, you know, surgeries and this and that. And, you know, I try to really, really maintain my body a little bit more by leaving a little bit in the tank on the power, you know, the power moves. But on the, the bottom of the side of things, I'll go a little harder on those. And I don't know, I know Dave, you know, is notorious for his workouts are like, get it pumped, kill it quick. Like his, you know, his arm one workout hour, takes 20 hour, minutes. Yeah, one like, hour in and out. Just, just a bicep workout. I thought it take 20 minutes. It's, yeah. So, I mean, it's like, it's a, is that the mentality you follow? Like, train it, train it till failure, everybody, but to, when you're doing a body part, is it trained till failure on every single session? I remember Lee Haney once said, and he was, what, eight time Mr. Was Olympia? That thing I remember it was, it was stimulate, stimulate, don't stimulate. annihilate. Yeah. And that was his thing, and, and it obviously worked for him. I just, I think because it came so hard to me, and that I was such a hard gainer, I think I learned from the beginning to take every single, so like I'm gonna do everything that I can to do this thing called bodybuilding. And, I, and if that means I have to take every set till I can't fire the muscle either positively or even let the bar down slowly anymore, which is negative failure, then that's what I'll do. And I figured, well, if other people are more genetically blessed than me, the one thing I can do better than them is to train harder than them. So I adopted a training style that involves after the warm-up sets, every single set is positive and then negative failure to a point where like on a chest press, someone will get the dumbbells up for me at that last rep and I can't even lower it, it just comes tumbling down on my face. And that's my last rep. Now, in order to do that and actually grow, you have to recover from that, which is how I came up with the four day a week schedule that I have. That, that accommodates that training style, but that's how I will uh, have always and will always train. It's just what I do.